Hello guys, here's Ed Myers again with a new video. So today we start a new series um, which I call um, Command Block for Noobs. So first, what, what I'm gonna learn you if you don't already know, sorry, is how to get a command block. So what you wanna do is slash git your name and I did that with tab if you didn't knew it and 137 and 1 so 137 is the ID of the command block so that's the only way to get a command block so here are a little, little thing pretty cool I think so this is really useful um, to like spawn mobs a specified number of mobs or give a certain number of items with command blocks so can uh, it's actually working with uh, comments so as you can see I have this comment already copy pasted so um, mobs is the name of my scoreboard I'm gonna explain this all a little bit later but let's say I want to uh, give myself seven blocks so I'm gonna um, tap enter so I already have one so you can see I gave myself eight of quartz so really precise really cool so let's see how it's working so the first thing uh, we want to do is actually create a scoreboard if you don't know how to do it just type this and then tab it's gonna type it for you then space and tab again so it's gonna make objectives space tab again you can press tab again to go to add then you want to type the name of your uh, scoreboard I'm gonna then name mine um, I don't know reds why not and then you want to press space and tab and press tab until you get to dummy and click enter so you should see that message that your objective is now added successfully so what you want to do after that we're gonna start build so place command block repeater on one tick another one over here two rest on dust another one here um repeater on one tick comparator block torch over here block over here dispenser over here then you can place whatever you want or oh, maybe you can use a uh, pound eggs also to make a really cool effect um so then you want to get a redstone block which I don't have on me so so this is to make a one tick pulse like that if you didn't knew so now you can enter the command in here so actually you can't use a tab in the console of command blocks so I'm gonna have to type it all hopefully you don't make errors so you can type uh, you don't need slash um, scoreboard space uh, players remove uh, I don't know how to you call that thing but do that <laughs> then open like these bracket or I don't know how you call them in English and type score um, oh my god I feel so stupid <laughs> yeah that you know what it is um, the name of your of your uh, scoreboard the capitals are really important if you put uh, them in your names and then min equals to one and you can close it and then you're gonna put one over here so this is gonna what's gonna do it's gonna remove one uh, two uh, wait yeah I forget that sorry you need to place reds the name before the number it's gonna remove one 
two reds if reds is bigger than one or equal to one so let's do that so now I'm just gonna take that and change mobs for reds so this comment is actually scoreboard player set on my name reds uh, to five so this is to get to drop five of them so we can try it hope you, it's working should have yeah so it's working we can try again oh let's say 15 so as you can see it's real precise really useful for map makers really uh, compact and if you want to make this seamless all you have to do is do that like that then you can have your walls also working as you can see and you have with that design and I'm sure you're gonna find a way with this design also but you can place a upper on top um, to have like infinite amount of stuff and just to show you what I want to mean like I want to spawn zombies so I want to spawn three zombies so that's three zombies so I hope it, it's um, helped you or maybe you will use it it will be really cool and yeah so see you next time guys Ooh.